Prince Daniel, will you be my valentine? Sorry, princess, I can't. Why not? My mom says I have an arranged marriage <laughs> to another princess. Prince William, are you ready for our Valentine's Day? <laughs> <gasps> princess Elizabeth! Date. It's not what it looks like. Give me back my heart. I'm sorry. I didn't realize he was with you, princess. I'm just gonna go. Elizabeth, you only have one heart left, and if it breaks, something horrible will happen to you. No more dating. What? I'm sorry, but you don't have a good taste in men. I will be picking a husband for you. Elizabeth, meet your husband-to-be, Prince Darren. Hello. Mwah. She's beautiful. Give him your heart. I promise to take good care of it. Give him your heart. I promise to take good care of it. Mother, may I speak to you in private, please? Of course. I'm not giving him my heart. Ugh, Elizabeth, why not? Because I was getting a really creepy vibe from him. Didn't you see the way that he was smirking at me? That's what men do when they like you. Mom, no they don't. You need someone to protect your heart, and that's what he's going to do. This is my last heart, and I'm not trusting that prince with it. If she doesn't believe me, then I have no choice but to run away. Excuse me. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to frighten you. I'm just a commoner. And you? You're the princess. I'm realizing now I probably shouldn't have left the palace with my crown on. I see her. She's down there. They found me. What's wrong? I need you to keep my heart safe. Princess, I couldn't. Please. Get her. Please take it. This is my last heart, and if it breaks... Something bad will happen to you. Someone's trying to break it. I will do my best to protect your heart, princess. Get her. Run. But what about- Run! Running away from the castle, are we? Come here. I found her, your majesty. Let go of me. Elizabeth. Where is your heart? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? I mean I don't know, because I gave it to another man. What? What was his name? I'm not sure, mother. I didn't ask. Could I have a moment with my fiancé alone? Of course, your highness. You can play all the games you want, princess. I will marry you, and I will find the man who took your heart. Look all you want. You're not gonna find him. We shall see. Prince Darren, we have found him. They were too fast, princess. I'm sorry. Where is the princess's heart? Well, that's the thing, Prince Darren. You may have caught me, but she'll never find where I hid the princess's heart. How dare you hide my daughter's heart? My queen, I say we send him to the torture chamber. No! It's the only way to get him to talk. Mother, please. Elizabeth, Prince Darren is right. He still won't talk. We only got his name. William. Ugh. Mother, let me speak to him, please. He will tell me where my heart is. Oh my goodness. What have they done to you? I promise to keep your heart safe, and I don't break my promises. I can't let you suffer for me. But the prince that you're supposed to marry, I can tell. He is evil. I know, William. But that's my problem, not yours. Where's my heart? Finally, her heart is where it belongs. All right, Mother. Prince Darren has my heart. Now let William go. No, dear. I'm afraid I can't do that. William is going to be killed. William is going to be killed for stealing your heart and hiding it. It must be done. I told him to do it. Oh, Elizabeth. You're just trying to protect him, I know. It was such a tough decision, Princess. May I speak to her alone? Of course, Darren. Don't be so sad. Get away from me. <laughs> we shall be married tomorrow. I will never marry you. Oh, but you will. That is, if you want William to live. Marry me tomorrow, and I'll convince your mother to let him live. And if you try anything, I will break your last heart. Do you understand? Do you accept Prince Darren as your husband? I do. Excellent. Now may I kiss the bride. Stop! That prince is evil. William? He escaped? And he's lying. It's true, Mother. He's been threatening me. What? I warned you not to speak against no. me. Her heart. Why is nothing happening? Because it was my last heart, not yours. William! Stop! Stop the wedding. That prince is evil. William? He escaped? And he's lying. No, it's true, Mother. Prince Darren has been threatening me. I warned you not to speak against me. No! Her heart. Why is nothing happening? Because that was my last heart, oh, not yours. William, his last heart, it's broken. What happens when your last heart breaks? I'm pretty sure you... You die. <laughs> How could you? Mom, there has to be something that we can do for him. Elizabeth, I'm so sorry. This is all my fault. 
Just be happy that it wasn't your heart. Arrest him. Get off of me. You should be arresting him. He took her real heart. My heart? I can give him my heart. William, where did you put my real heart? I... <sighs> William? Elizabeth? Don't speak to me. Darling, they found it. The gods found your heart. My heart? Do you think it'll work if I give it him? I'm not sure, dear, but it's worth a try. William, I want to give you my last heart. Please wake up. Heart oh. share. <gasps> William. Elizabeth. Princess. Shut up. So, what did your future say? It said that I'm going to become a princess. Well, hun, it's true. What? You know how I've been dating this guy? Yeah. He asked me to marry him last night. Well, Mom, I'm really happy for you, but what does that have to do with me being a princess? <laughs> well, it turns out that he's, um, a king. So once I marry him, you and I will be... Royalty. I'm gonna be a princess. Come on, you have to meet his kids. I'd like you to meet my son and daughter, Luke and Lacey. Hello. Hi. Are you seriously not even gonna curtsy? Oh, was I supposed to? Um, duh. Hey, honey, next time curtsy, okay? Otherwise, it's very disrespectful. My kids can be a bit harsh on new guests, but they will warm up to you. We are not letting her become our new stepsister. Definitely not. I think it's time for a little sabotage. They're gonna try and change my future. They're trying to change my future. Why are you looking at me like that? I heard what you guys were saying. Oh yeah, what did we say? That you were gonna try and sabotage our parents' wedding, and I'm not gonna let you do that. I'm sorry. Things have been rough since our mom passed. We shouldn't have said, Hey, it's okay. I understand. Things have been pretty hard for me, too. Your dad passed away, huh? Yeah. We shouldn't have tried to plot against you. How about we call it a truce, okay? Hey, wanna play a game? Okay. Cool, let's say our biggest fears. You go first. Mine is snakes. Oh, you don't like snakes, huh? Interesting. This is what you get for spying on our conversation. Sweet dreams. <laughs> Sweetheart, breakfast is ready. <gasps> A fake snake, really? We're sorry, Daddy. We were just playing. We didn't mean any harm. You're grounded. Sophia, please accept my apology gift. <coughs> you got her a puppy? Yes, and I hope it makes up for the scare you two caused her. Thank you, Your Majesty. Of course. She gets a puppy and we get grounded? So not fair. Well, I think my future is secured as a princess. Wait, what? Hey, Sophia, do you think you could help me clean my room? I think my future is secured as a princess. Wait, what? Hey, Sophia, do you think you could help me clean my room? I know what you're trying to do. What? You're trying to make me your maid. How did you... Did your future change? Yeah, it did. Haven't you two seen the movie Cinderella? Do you really want to be known as the evil step-siblings? We're not evil. We're just trying to make our new stepsister useful. I'm telling our parents. If you try and tell them, I'll make our dad call off the wedding. Our parents are in love. It'll crush them. We know. So we suggest you keep your mouth shut. All you gotta do is agree to do whatever we say, and... We won't stand in the way of our parents' wedding. Come on, you don't want to be the reason they break up. You guys promise you won't sabotage their marriage? Kinky swear. So, do we have a deal or not? Fine. Yay! Now hand me the puppy. Now get to cleaning. You can start with my room first. <laughs> oh, I don't feel so good. Me either. Nice try. You're not going to fool me again. We're being for real. We feel sick. <gasps> Help. <laughs> nice acting. I'm not falling for that anymore. Uh, no, seriously. Something's wrong. Uh, I can't breathe. I think we're having an allergic reaction. Oh my gosh, who would do this? Me. These brats have been nothing but rude to me my whole time here. So today I made them a special meal. Look, I know they're not the nicest, but you can't do this. They will die. It is too late for them now. No, they have to have an EpiPen or something. <laughs> you won't be able to find it in time. Oh! The puppy brought me this. Is this... That's our medicine. You have to inject us with it. Uh. Oh. Your Majesty, are they going to be okay? Yes, they're going to be alright. I cannot thank you enough. Mom, you look amazing. Oh, honey, thank you. I'm so nervous to walk down the aisle. Well, don't be. Everything's gonna be fine. Hey. Can we talk to you for a sec? Sure. 
We wanted to say thank you for saving us. And we want to offer you something for the future in return. I was supposed to be next in line for the throne, but I want to give it to you. You guys, really, I can't accept. Please, it's the least we can do. Yeah, I mean, you saved our lives, even after we treated you like trash. We're so sorry, and we think you'll make a great queen. We promise to treat you like our sister now. So, deal? Okay, deal. Your test scores are in. Your intelligence level will now appear above your head. What does mine say? You got a six. Yes! Wait, what does mine say? You got a two. What? I have been refreshing Instagram for the past five minutes. Why will nothing load? That's because I unplugged the internet. You need to read more. Mom, reading isn't going to make my number go up. You listen to me. You're an embarrassment to this whole family. So you get that number up by the end of the month or you're out of here. Crystal, what is up with you? Here, take this, okay? What is this? It stimulates the neurons in your brain, which causes a chemical reaction, which allows you to process information at a Okay, hold on. English, please. Look, basically, it makes you super smart. This is a prank, isn't it? Look, I know I'm not that smart, but I'm also not that dumb either, so... Crystal, I made my intelligence level go up. See? Wait, how did you do that? I'm telling you, it's the pill. Look, I'm not supposed to be doing this, but just take it. Jamie, wait. I have to go. Hey, they're handing out graduation gowns right now. I don't think she's going to need one of those, if you know what I mean. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll see about that. I swear this pill better freaking work. Crystal? Crystal? Are you still with us? <laughs> What's the answer to number two? Well, it's simple math, really. You take the numerator, divide it by the denominator, multiply that times 2, which will give you 81, of course, and then you take the square root, which will give you 9. How'd she do that? What the hell? Correct, but Crystal, what? your number went up. How'd you solve that equation so fast? That was a warm-up question. Any fifth grader could have solved it. Really? Because you seem pretty impressed by it. Yeah, only because you were so dumb before. How did you make your intelligence level go up, though? You don't like me, do you? Uh, yeah, no shit, Sherlock. Yeah, but why is that? I mean, we were such good friends until high school. It's because of Jamie, isn't it? She intimidates you? She does not! She does. Which explains why you never make direct eye contact with her. You feel like she replaced you as my best friend. You a psychologist all of a sudden? Come on, Viv, let's go. And you two are dating now, aren't you? What? How do you know? The way that he's protective over you, it indicates that he cares about your feelings. And you two also smell very similar, which tells me that you're probably... Watch it, Crystal! Mind your own business. How the hell did I know all that? Guess who got an A on every test today? Mom? Guess she's not home yet. Ah. Oh. Ow. Oh. Hello? Hey, there's something I have to tell you about the pills. Is it that they have side effects? Because I think I'm feeling them right now. Oh no. Um, just... Oh. Just hang on. I'll be right there. Okay. Help. Oh my gosh, Crystal, here, you have to take this. Are you feeling alright now? Yeah, much better. Good, but about the pills, if you stop taking them, you... You what? You... you die. Jamie, are you kidding me right now? How could you not tell me about this? I... I didn't find out until yesterday. Where are those pills from? I'm gonna be in so much trouble. They're from a lab that my sister works at. I sort of stole them. This is 30 days worth. So about a month. Jamie, what happens when these run out? Uh... Hold my drink. Okay. I gotta use the bathroom. Thanks for holding this. Of course. This is good, babe. Mm, I thought you might like it. What's it called? It's called, uh, Taken by Surprise. Why is it called that? That's why. Just one more kill and you're rid of me. You're gonna miss me, aren't you? You wish. Well, tomorrow's assignment is no joke. Go get some sleep. You're gonna need it. He's actually kinda cute. Damn it, stop it. No attachments. This is for your freedom. So you're telling me that this guy's a billionaire? Yes, and he's got two bodyguards. So you gotta work your charm and get him alone. Then, you're gonna give him some of this. It looks like water, but if he drinks it, BAM! He's dead.
Think you can handle it? If it means I never have to see your face again, then yes. Hey. Hey. What's your name? My name is... <clears throat> uh, Are you always this articulate? <laughs> uh, Brett, sorry. My name's Brett. And that's why I hate snakes. <laughs> so, are those big, strong men over there your bodyguards? Yeah, I have them for my protection. Oh. Is, uh, is something wrong? Oh, nothing. It's just, I wish we could go somewhere a little more... alone. This better? Yes, but uh, do you think you could get me some water? Yeah. One sec. Cheers to, uh, one of the most beautiful girls I... I think I've ever met. Wait! To, uh, one of the most beautiful girls I... I think I've ever met. Wait! What? Your drink, it... it has a bug in it. No, don't... And that ruined my carpet? You'll... you'll thank me later. It's alright, I've been meaning to redo this place anyways. So you've been single for a while now? Yeah. Huh. You know, for me, it's always been kind of hard to stay alone. Sometimes it's better to be alone. No one can hurt you. Hey, listen, I... I get why you feel like that. But I want you to know, I'm not that type of guy. We should stop this before... I... So you're telling me he's not dead? I am done working for you. No, no, sweetheart. We had a deal. You remember the obedience necklace, right? <laughs> Don't make me use it. So tomorrow, no security, just you and me. That sounds great. I'll... I'll see you then. Good job. And tomorrow, you get that kill count up to 50. Hey. Hi. Remember, I'm watching you. You okay? Yeah, uh, do you think you could just get me some water? Yeah, of course. Okay, when he comes back, you know what to do. Got your... Natasha, what are you doing? I'm sorry. Don't do this. I don't have a choice. You have five seconds to take the shot. I don't know who's making you do this, but you always have a choice. Do it! Three, two, one. No! Run. Uh. Guess I'll have to do it myself. Say goodbye to your freedom and your little boyfriend. Wait! How could you? You wanted 50 kills? Uh. Well, you got it. Security! Let's see those hands! If they need to arrest me, I understand. Actually, I work for the CIA, and if you're willing to come work with us, we'll drop all the charges. Does that sound like a deal? Yes, I would like that. Thank you, Brett. You saved my life. I'll never forget that. Time to take your vitamins. Mom, do I have to? They make my head hurt. That means they're working. What exactly are they doing for me? Shh, open. Mom, stop. I can take it myself. Okay, let me see. Good job. Next one's at lunch? Yeah, okay, I know. You're gonna make me late. Hey, cool if I sit here for lunch? Sure. Why does no one talk to you? Um... FaceTime from Mom. I'm really sorry, but I have to take this, um, in private. Mom, oh my god, this is so embarrassing. Look, I just need to see you take it. There, are you happy? Yes, good job, honey. I love you. Why? This is why I'm never gonna have any friends. <laughs> hey, what the hell? Where did you come from? They're after me. There isn't much time. You need to stop taking those vitamins. They're... Stop taking those vitamins. They're suppressing your powers. Powers? Yes, you're a special just like your father. Oh, what? How do you know my father? I'm out of time. Just don't take those pills tonight and you'll see what happens. No, wait! <laughs> okay, it's time. Good job, honey. You just earned yourself some dessert. She's got to stop treating me like I'm five. Kara, vitamin time. Okay, I'm coming. Go on, take it. What's wrong? Kara, don't tell her anything. She can't be trusted. Honey, what? Uh, nothing. Never mind. Uh-huh. Well, don't be late to class now. Bye, Mom. No, Kara, wait. I found your vitamins in the trash. Why were they in the trash? The better question is, why are you making me take them? I know they're not really vitamins. How do you know that? I just... I just know, okay? Damn it. Derek found you, didn't he? Who? Never mind. You have to take them. No, Mom. I'm going to school. Don't tell me no. You will take them. I know what's best. Open your mouth. No, you... you stay back. Oh, You are in so much... I know I have powers. Honey, you don't even know how to use them. <laughs> yeah, I do. Just watch. <laughs> Come on. Work. Ow. 
I'm sorry, Kara, but I have to do this to protect you. Oh, okay, just stay there. Can you hear me? Mom. It's all right. Open your mouth. Mom, no! Mm. <coughs> Kara? <coughs> yes, my plan worked. Hey, it's all right. You're safe now. Dad? Dad? Kara, you look so grown up. Yeah, no shit. You left when I was eight. I was forced to leave you, Kara. I was being hunted. Hunted? By who? Ultra. An organization set on eliminating our kind. It was your mom's biggest fear that you would become a special. A special as in having special powers? Yes. We think you might be the most powerful out of all of us. I don't think I can trust you guys. I don't even know how I got here. All of us specials are connected. Somehow you knew subconsciously to teleport here. My dad was a special too, and Ulta killed him. And they would have gotten me as well if it weren't for your dad. Please, I just want to keep you safe. Specials have either teleportation, telepathy, or telekinesis. We think you have all three. Okay, so how do I learn how to use them? Now use your telepathy to put a number in Derek's mind. Are you saying five? Yes. She really has all three powers. I want to try teleportation now. Hold on, that one's hard. I just want to try it. Kara, wait. <laughs> Honey? <laughs> see how much mommy and daddy love me, or see how much are in their bank account? I already know mommy and daddy love me, so let's see how much money they have. <gasps> wow, they have a billion dollars? I must be getting a lot of Christmas presents this year. Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas! Thank you! What else did you get me? That's it, Pumpkin. We didn't get you anything else. Mommy and Daddy are very poor. But I see that you have a lot of money. Uh, there must have been a mistake. Don't sound spoiled. Be grateful. So, guys, any chance I'm gonna get a phone for my birthday? <laughs> oh, poor thing. No, you're too young. Yeah, I figured you were gonna say that. But when do you think I will be old enough to have a phone? You'll get next one next year. Next year, you literally say that every year. No, we don't. In other news, today marks 16 years since billionaires Mr. and Mrs. Connor's baby daughter went missing. Wait, that baby kind of looks like... me. In other news, today marks 16 years since billionaires Mr. and Mrs. Connor's baby daughter went missing. Wait, that baby kind of looks like... me. If you have any information, we urge you to call this number. That can't be me. I'm just being delusional. We should give her back now. The reward is one million dollars. But how do we get the reward money for her without them knowing we took her in the first place? Shh, let's talk about it over here. The number on the TV. They said to call it if... If you have any information, we urge you to call this number. I need a phone. I'll have to take mom and dad's. No, I just gotta call this number. No, I just gotta call this number. What the hell was that? <gasps> you want to tell us why you were in our room? And why my phone is cracked? I, um, I didn't think you guys saw me. I was just, um... What is this? She knows we're not her parents. She was trying to call the number on the news, huh? Well, you know what? It's about time she found out. Surprised it took her this long. I mean, how could she never question how we all have different hair and eyes and why we never let her on social media? I mean, come on. You two are sick, and I'm leaving. No, you're not. Now turn. We gotta make you look pretty for your billionaire mommy and daddy. They'll be so happy. And the final touch, a little bow. Aw, oh, babe, isn't she so cute? Your birth parents are offering a big reward for you, so you better not mess this up. Now, get into that box, and no talking. Now, get into that box, and no talking. Richard, what in heavens did you order? This box is not from... Me. What is going on? Read the note. It'll explain everything. Your prayers have been answered. Here is your biological daughter. We have to send the one million dollar reward to this number or you die? Yes, so please just wire it to them right now and I'm so sorry about all of this. Darling, this doesn't sound right. I think we ought to just call the police. Yes, darling, I agree. No, please, no, police. I, I can prove to you that I'm your real daughter. I know how much is in your bank accounts. It's two billion, exactly. How do you know that? Because I picked to see how much money were in my parents' bank account. It says if we don't send it, she will die. What if she is our daughter? Can you please just send them the money? No, I have to call the police. <laughs> I'm not sending anyone money. I have to call the police. Wait. No. We have to get her to a hospital. 
Doctor, is she going to be okay? Ma'am, we can't have you in here. Mr. and Mrs. Connors, we have some good news. She's going to be okay, and we did the blood test as you requested, and it does look like she is your biological daughter. Richard, did you hear that? I can't believe it. Hi, darling. Don't worry. Everything is all right. Those horrible people have been put in prison. What's going to happen to me now? We're going to take care of you, love. You are? Yes, we, um, we found out you're actually our daughter. I knew it. We never stopped looking for you. Your father and I missed you so much. We love you. Hey, what's the matter? No one's ever told me that before. Well, we'll be telling you that every day, love. Now you get some rest, and we'll be here when you wake up. My best friend controls my bank account or my hand? Yeah, I don't need her making me go broke. She's out of town, so I wonder how this is going to work. Incoming call. Oh, it's her. Hey. Girl, I can see and hear everything you do. You can? Yeah, this is so weird. Don't worry, I won't make you do anything bad. You may now begin your test. What are you doing? I swear, I'm not trying to do this. <sighs> Maya, why would you do something like that? Revenge? For what? You need to see this. What is this? A picture of you and Maya's boyfriend, and it looks like you're holding hands. What? Yeah, it's been sent out to the whole school. Maya, I swear, this isn't what it looks like. I can't believe her. I'm going to make her week a living hell. Maya, listen, I wasn't cheating with your boyfriend. I was just... Mm. I don't want to hear her excuses. I saw the photo. They were clearly holding hands. Are you okay? Mm. No, my best friend is controlling my hand today, and she's super mad at me. Dang, it sucks to be you. <laughs> yeah, can't say I disagree. Maya, if you would just let me explain... Excuse me. You need to pay attention. I take Jim very seriously. Of course. Uh, so do I, Coach. Are you mocking me, Miss Missouri? No, sir. Oh, you think you're funny, huh? Go run five laps. No, but I... Uh-uh-uh. Don't want to hear it. Let's go. <sighs> oh, man. Oh, my gosh. I'm so thirsty. Here, you can have my water. Oh, thank you. Thanks again for the water. No problem. <gasps> what the... That's what you get for being a bad friend. Maya, all week you've been causing me trouble, and any time I try and explain what happened with your boyfriend, you... You do that. I don't care what you have to say anymore. I can't trust you. Oh, and I see her crush is coming near. Oh, no, Nate, Maya, please, I'm begging you, don't... Hey, uh, how are you doing? Good. Great, actually. Sweet. Well, you know, prom's coming up, right? Yeah. I was wondering if you... <laughs> Nate? She just knocked out Nate. No, no, I would never. My friend is controlling my hand. Principal's office now. Listen, this is all just a big misunderstanding. Great, they put handcuffs on her. Now I can control her hand. What do you mean she's your sign language instructor? Wait, so that's why she was touching your hand? Why didn't you call me sooner? She's about to get arrested. Take her downtown. No, please wait. Stop. I was controlling her officers. Okay, what'd you get? A mermaid. What? I mean, that would explain the pink in her hair. Honey, she's lying. No, it really says that. Shh, that is enough of your nonsense. Hi, pretend mermaid. We know that's not your hair. It is. Okay, let's see. Ow. You probably glued it. Don't lie about your future. I'm not. It really does say that. Mermaids don't exist. Stop trying to get attention. Hey, how was your day? Horrible. No one believes me. <sighs> Honey, there's something I need to tell you. What are you talking about? Your mom and I aren't your real parents. What? We found you as a baby by the beach, and that was in your hands. So, let me get this straight. You found me on the beach as a baby, holding this necklace? Yeah, honey, I know this is a lot to take in. Well, I mean, didn't you look for my parents? They they could have been around somewhere. We did. We were the only ones at that beach. It was a private beach. But you know, I really do believe your future. And I think your real parents are still out there. Do you really think so? Yeah, I do. I think you should wear the necklace. What is going on? Dad told me the truth about everything. What? We agreed to wait until she was 18. <laughs> no, look, I know now that my future is true, and I think this might be the key to me finding my real parents. 
Give me that. No more nonsense. But that's mine. As your mother, it belongs to me. He told her everything. I know her transformation is coming. That's why I need you to get over here to help me with her. Get in the car, we're leaving. Wait, what? Hello, nice to meet you, Merlina. What is going on? What is this place? This is my laboratory. I study your kind. My kind? Yes, mermaids, of course. But I thought mermaids didn't exist. Right, Mom? I actually believe your future, honey. You made me feel like I was crazy. I was just trying to protect you. No, I want to go home. But Merlina, look what I have. We just want to help you transform. And you can find your real parents. Do you promise? Yes. We just want to help. So what do you need me to do? Okay, now repeat after me. I wish I was a mermaid. I wish I was a mermaid. It's working. The necklace is magic. Her future is changing. Oh no, you can't breathe? You were right. She is the princess. I can't believe she's a princess. This is amazing. Mom, you're awake. How do you know my future? Shh, just rest. I don't feel good. I know, honey. It's because you're still in your mermaid form. It's okay. We got you a tank. Tank? Yes, but in the meantime, we have you hooked up to two IV machines. We just need a few more blood samples. Can you believe mermaids have blue blood? Honey, can you hear me? Dad? Yeah, it's gonna be okay. This has gotta come off. Hey, you feel better, right? Yes, how did you know that would turn me back human? Because your real mother had one just like it. You see, one day I was out fishing and I noticed a woman asking for help on the shore. She was a mermaid and after I saved her, we fell in love. She got this magic necklace from her father that she said helped her stay human. But the day I proposed, she left me. Why? Wait, so does that mean you're my real dad? Yeah, I think I am. For many years I didn't believe it. Because when Sylvia left me, she didn't say why. She was a queen. Wait, what? Why do you say that? My future. It changed a princess after I put on that necklace. Oh my gosh, so your mom was a queen. She must have left me to go back to her people. But I don't understand. If mom left you, then how was I born? Well, I realized something. I think your mom was pregnant when she left me. Because nine months later, I found this on the beach. This was me? <laughs> yep. I think your mom left you there for me so you could have a normal life. But that really wasn't the case. As soon as you learned how to crawl, all you wanted to do was go in the water. You loved anything that had to do with the ocean. And my new wife started to catch on. That's not normal. Where did she get that pink streak? She became obsessed with researching things about you, but she never wanted you to know. That's right, I didn't. I'm not letting you ruin my research. You have water powers. Use them. What are you doing? Making sure you don't bother me ever again. <gasps> Merlina, that was amazing. Red alert. We have to go. Come on. All right, you got the necklace on. Now wish to be a mermaid. But dad... I'm sorry, but that scientist told too many people about you. You're not safe here anymore. You belong under the sea with your real mom. That's the police. You gotta make the wish now. When you find your mom, tell her I love her. I will never forget you. I'll find a way to see you again. I love you. I wish to be a mermaid. <gasps> mom? No, it can't be. Darling? It's you, my baby. I knew you'd find me. My lost daughter has returned. This has been waiting for you. You are now Princess Merlina. All hail your new mermaid princess.